Now let's talk about how we're going to sync iCloud to your MacBook. Let's get started. So at first, what we need to do is to ensure that we have the same iCloud synced between all of your devices, right? So if you have like, um, like iPhone, iPads, Macs, you want to ensure that you are logged in with the same Apple ID if you want to sync files across all of them. But essentially on your Mac, open up the settings or system preferences and a tap on your name at the top. Once you are in here, you can proceed to the iCloud section. And in there, essentially, you can find the iCloud drive right there. And you want to ensure that the sync this Mac is turned on. Obviously, there are some other things as well, like optimized storage and a desktop folders and stuff like that, which you can go through, right? But essentially, you want to ensure that it is like synced this way and that the syncing is turned on. So then when I go to my files on like iPhone and go to iCloud Drive, I'm going to be able to access everything, right? If it's all synced and turned on properly. A lot of times, if you don't really know what's on your iCloud and what's on your local storage, I like to basically use the web browser to access only my iCloud, right? So I just open up Safari, go to iCloud.com and log in with my Apple ID. And of course, whatever I see there through the Safari browser is only on iCloud. So this is a great way how you can distinct between the content which is on the cloud and which is on your local storage. So just a little quick tip right there, which I like to use. And this is all that you really need to know about it. I most definitely have some other iCloud related videos on this channel. So go ahead and subscribe below so you never miss the new ones and tutorials about literally all of the topics about like tech and iPhones, iPads, whatever. So go ahead and subscribe right now and I'll see you later in the next videos.